And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Clear and cold yesterday, seeing a high temperature of 17 degrees, dipping down to zero by about 11 p.m. to midnight late last night, early this morning. Now, temperatures are right back up to 17 degrees again. Winds are from the southwest currently, mainly cloudy skies throughout the viewing area. We're seeing those temperatures up to 16. Rensselaer, it's 19 right now in Rossville. The same story in Kokomo, stepping out the door this morning. However, wind chills, the southwesterly winds moving in anywhere between 5 to 10 miles per hour throughout the majority of the viewing area, while our wind chill here in Los Lafayette is 12. We're seeing other portions of the region in the single digits. Feels like 7 in Rossville as well as Crawfordsville this morning. So what has changed over the last 5 to 6 hours that changed those temperatures so drastically? Well, here it is. One, we had the warmer, more moist air mass moving in, bringing that cloud cover along with it. And cloud cover during the overnight hours acts almost like a blanket, keeping temperatures at the surface a bit milder. So just as that cloud cover moves in, we see those temperatures begin to increase. On top of that, we're dealing with an area of high pressure off across the southeastern United States. That continues to pull moisture in from the Gulf of Mexico along with warmer conditions, feeding it to a round of low pressure off to the west of us, and that is bringing that warm front a little bit closer to our region this morning, and as a result, temperatures are already on the rise. Now, we are expecting plenty of cloud cover throughout the day ahead. Some filtered sunlight here and there, mainly cloudy to partly cloudy skies, but at least those temperatures will be a bit more comfortable than they were yesterday afternoon. In fact, we should see temperatures on the increase throughout much of the day, warming us all the way back up to around 34 in West Lafayette later on this afternoon. We'll have 35 in Kokomo and 35 as well in Kentland later today before dipping back down into the mid to upper 20s across the viewing area. We'll dip fall all the way back off to around 27 degrees here in West Lafayette. The scattered cloud cover sticks around maybe a bit clearer during the overnight hours, but check out those winds still gusting from the south southwest 10 to 20 miles per hour throughout the overnight hours into early Saturday morning. As for tomorrow, I'm still expecting a decent amount of cloud cover. In fact, I'd like to see even more than what's on our precision future cast for tomorrow. Mostly cloudy skies are expected once again. However, temperatures will run even warmer. We still have that area of high pressure off to our southeast feeding us those southerly winds driving temperatures up to 40 degrees for tomorrow. Mainly cloudy, mild, but breezy. Winds will be gusting as high as 25 miles from the south southwest tomorrow afternoon. We'll even hit the 40s again on Sunday. This time, however, it comes with a chance of rainfall making its way back into the viewing area. We are tracking a round of low pressure that should push back into the region as early as Sunday morning, early afternoon. That system will continue to progress right across the viewing area. We'll reach 42 degrees during the afternoon as rainfall. However, once those temperatures begin to decrease, we'll fall off to around 21 that night, leaving us a chance for a wintry mixture on the back edge of that system. Now, Monday, we dry out for a brief period. 27, your high temperature that day. Tuesday, 34. Slight chances of a wintry mixture that day, but that warm front moves in just in time for Wednesday, hitting 30 Nine degrees, slight chance of rainfall that morning. Then that cold front rolls right through. Plummets temperatures down to 12 degrees that night. We only reach a high temperature of 14 degrees to wrap up that precision seven day on Thursday. Slight chance of lake effect snowfall that afternoon. So just enjoy the uh, warmer temperatures, I guess. Yeah, it's uh, 40s. Oh, 40s yeah. feeling just wonderful. Uh, today, even nice. A little bit on the breezy side, so it still will be relatively cool, but a heck of a lot better than yesterday. We only re reached that high temperature in the mid to upper teens. Plenty of sunshine. That was the one plus yesterday, something that I'm sure we'll all be missing a little bit over the next few days. Here. Yeah, for sure. Thanks yeah. very much, Cam.